Today, we are talking about engaging worship. We enter into worship to actively seek an encounter with the living God. And we leave from worship being better able to interpret the world around us from God's perspective. True worship changes all the other hours of our week. As you can see, I'm standing in our sanctuary, the beautiful place that's been set apart specifically for us together to express our devotion and our thanksgiving to God. But we know that worship can happen anywhere besides just in the sanctuary. The last several weeks we have been unable to gather together because of the coronavirus, but our worship continues. The online services give us an opportunity to come together in prayer, in scripture, in the message, and in music. And through all of those elements, we are filled with the Holy Spirit. True worship transforms lives, heals wounded souls, renews hope, and inspires compassion. Psalm 95 says, Come, let us bow down and worship. Let us kneel before the Lord, our Maker, for He is God, and we are the people of His pasture.